Thanks for checking out this episode of Brutal Battle Beer Break. Uh, today we're doing yet another beer from The Brewery out of Placentia, California. Uh, they also list Orange County on there, which, you know, that's the county, obviously. But um, this is a 16.3% alcohol by volume beer. It is called White Mocha, and it's basically a variation on their very popular white chocolate, which is a wheat wine. So in this instance, it is a wheat wine that's uh, bourbon barrel aged with cocoa nibs and coffee. So, sounds good. I did like the white mocha when I had it. It was a nice, easy beer for being bourbon barrel Asian, being super high alcohol. So, I think the addition of that coffee in here will be quite nice. But, we'll find out for sure. All right. A little foily doohickey on here. Which sometimes is kind of tough to get off. Not going to lie. Oh, that wasn't too bad. I don't know if that's because it wasn't too hard or I just wasn't as dumb this time. Oh, I can already smell the, the bourbon. As soon as I popped that cap off, a waft of, of bourbon scent just hit my nose, which is a good thing. Pour this sucker in just a little bit. All right, there's the white mocha label. All right, so... Uh, it looks very dark, you know, it's kind of a uh, brownish-orange coloration, can't see anything through it, it's very, very hazy, as you can see there's a nice head to it, partially because of the way I poured it, um, big bubbles on the top, a uh, little beige in the coloration for the head, ooh, whew. there's a lot, a lot, a lot of bourbon on that, but there's also a lot of cocoa nib in there, the coffee is very present as well, but the the bourbon and the cocoa nibs are what, let me move this aside a little, the bourbon and the cocoa nibs are what uh, dominate the most in the nose, at least right now. And it's almost kind of fudgy with those cocoa nibs too. And with the bourbon coming in as well, it's kind of like chocolate and caramel coming together. And then there's that coffee that kind of sits on the uh, end of the aroma. And you can smell that wheaty wheat wine Definitely smells high in ABV, <clears throat> almost kind of tickles my throat when I'm breathing in uh, and that alcohol vapor is kind of hitting back of my throat, so it kind of tickles a bit, but good stuff. Let's uh, go in. So velvety. Mm. Okay. The way it lays on my tongue, like I was saying, it's very velvety. It's very soft. It kind of just delicately goes on. It's kind of thick. You know, it's like a medium body to it, though. But like, you know, like me, medium heavy type body. Um, there's a lot of burn to it on the end because it is 16.3%. Um, but it's not crazy. And, I, and I'm assuming that as I keep sipping it, that burn's going to kind of come down a little bit and how much it's affecting my palate and the back of my throat. Um... There's a little bit of a, there, there's a decent sweetness on it, and almost a little bit of a tartness on the end. But there's a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of that bourbon, which is coming off with like some oaky notes, uh, a lot of caramel aspect in there, sweet. Um, and then you're getting that kind of like fudgy cocoa nib that's coming in after that. And then you're finishing out with the coffee. So the flavor is a lot like the aroma, uh, which is always a great thing for me. I always hate it when you get a really nice aroma and then it doesn't deliver on the flavor. Do I think the aroma is better than the flavor? I do. And that happens a lot of the time uh, with craft beers, but you know, it's normal. Is it still good? It is still quite good, quite good, which I expect from the brewery. So anyway, good stuff. Brewery always making good stuff. People, if you have any interest in any other beers you want to see me review, you can go ahead and send me an email, brutalbattlepodcast at gmail.com. If you don't listen to the actual podcast, you can just search Brutal Battle, spelled B-R-E-W-T-A-L, and then Battle. Uh, it's on iTunes, Stitcher, and Google Play now, and also just on the website, brutalbattle.com. So anyway, um, send me an email, brutalbattlepodcast at gmail.com. Thank you so much, everyone, for checking this out. Thank you, Brewery, for making nice beers like this. And everybody go have yourself an awesome beer.